Buongiorno a tutti. What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to my Reno mobile. Of course, we're going to cover some cultural news. Because tomorrow there's the national team playing against Venezuela in America. And the last three days I haven't been here and I shared be this, I shared be that. Might as well talk about it. And what just happened just recently, and my thoughts and yours, of course. Before anything, put a beautiful like and subscribe. And we're close to five, 400. Like, guys, let's put these subscriptions. Let's keep on going. And these likes. Bada bim, bada boom. Come on, let's go. But thank you for all the love and respect and support to all my fellow paisans out there either Juventino, uh, Interista, Purtroppo, uh, Milanista thank you for all the love and respect hoping to do a live on Friday but I keep you guys updated and we'll do a little recap of everything now with this Acerbi situation we all know on Sunday there was some uh, bad words from Acerbi to uh, Juan Jesus. They use the racist word, the N, which I don't want to say. And uh, of course, Achebe denies it. He said that uh, I said to him, Ti faccio nero, that I'll make you uh, black. In other words, in Italian, Ti faccio nero means that, the, you know, when you slap a person so hard, you, you make the face black, you know, with a lot of bruises. That's what he meant. But this is all case of him saving his ass and his agent, because based on the cameras and what Juan Jesus uh, said, you know, you can tell by the uh, linguaggio, the language, the body language, he did say that word. And funny, fair enough, he's not joining the national team. And uh, Mancini is going to be playing tomorrow instead of him. Then he might risk 10 days and he could risk his career. Because 10 days uh, during the campionat, it's going to be 9 days right now. So by the uh, end of the season, it's already over. Then he might not join the national team. So I don't know what to say. I don't know what your thoughts about this. I know Bench and uh, don't like the idea because, as they say, every big club should go against racism but Signora Cerbi if you pay the price Paghi you pay and you pay the consequences so and even his agent you know saying that uh, tried to defend that he said the ti faccio nero that doesn't make sense guys and plus as yesterday I was hearing from uh, Serie sit them. they were saying the same thing, you should ban him for life. But knowing the FGG, we all know the situation. Then Inter, it's always the most defensive team, if you ask me. But they're taking Provedimenti. He's not playing on the national team. He might risk his career. So, you know, unfortunately, adios. He's at that age, 36 years old. And it's unfortunate if he finishes his career by acting like that. What are your thoughts about that? Now, tomorrow about this national team. We'll see what happens. It's a friendly. I might watch it. I know some of my paisans are going to be there. Uh, we'll see what happens. Let's see these boys can get in the green tub whatsoever. So we can have a better picture at the Euro. Uh, I know Kiesa is playing. Uh, Mancini, as we said. Uh, of course, Bastoni. Barella, Di Marco, and Zoma. Some players did not show up. Keen did not uh, resign. He stayed at Torino. So. But like I said, man, uh, the, the people that are not, uh, they're not playing. They're a bunch of vagabondis. Like Keen, I'm sorry, Locatelli. So, maybe it's still like us. It's better that they stay at home. And maybe. Then uh, besides that, nothing much, man. Just to close it off with uh, Juventus, apparently. Elkan said at the end of the season, Allegri's out. This morning we hear the Gazzetta. The how the uh, Suceda wants him in the state. They said, that's all BS. I'm telling you right now. But from Nick Ruskia and from my fellow paisans, the voices of Tiago Motta are coming in the summer. So, get over your head. End of the season, Allegri's out. 
Thank God that Elkin is waking up, even in La Sociedad. But what, is, what really bothers me is people are saying, you know, that the players are not connected to the coach whatsoever. But it's even from La Sociedad. Scott Ambino is saying, we're happy with the coach, the players, and our goal is to be in the final of Copa Italia. Really? You think this is Juventus? The goal is to reach and win. Like, what are you talking It's like Real Madrid, uh, 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 what's his name? Uh, Fiorentino Perez said, uh, the goal is to reach the final of the champions and we'll see. No, your goal is to reach to the final and get it done. That's how supposed to be in a big club. With this new Sociedad that we have here, without Moji uh, Boniperti, it, it become a, a provincial, and I hope things can change. Because Elkan, he just cleans his hands, he wants to be politically incorrect, and you know, things need to change. I mean, we love Juventus. But besides that, forget about it. Forza Italia, uh, vive calcio, eh, Per favor, put a like and subscribe. I'll talk to you all pretty soon. Ciao, Ivo.